part two begins right now. up to the DVC lounge. Never been here, but I need to cool off and I need a drink. It's super, super hot out today. This area is for DVC members only. Membership has privileges. This part of the day was really hot. I mean, like 100 plus degrees hot. So I took a break. I went up to the DVC member lounge, which is for members only, and took advantage of the air conditioning, the view, and I even did a live stream right here, as you can see. Got my phone, and I was live. I'll put a card up in the corner for you to go ahead and watch it. They offer free Wi-Fi, but it wasn't very strong. Anyway, this was just so much fun to just hang out, drink some soda, and they had tons of different flavors. All free. All free for DVC members, so if you haven't been here, check it out. Time to take a break and have pork slaughter from Hawaii. A little soggy. They drenched it in some kind of liquor. See? Dripping. As good as it's ever been. But soggy. Heading over to the World Showplace that is in Future World. This was open for the Millennium Celebration uh, from 99 to 2000, and they reopened it recently for Taste of Epcot. This is a really cool place to cool off, and they have festival favorites from past years. Heading into the World Showplace, I've been in here since the Millennium Celebration. Actually, a lot. I went in here for one of the food and wine events. I think I did a party of the senses here and it was amazing. Hefty price tag, but it was amazing. Should I say gluttonous? Oh, lots of space in here. Let's see what we have available. This is the desserts and champagne menu. Six Thank you. I'm inside the World Show Place and I got this one on the left, which is the frozen apple pie. And then I also got a Banana Bliss Cider. It looks delicious. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try the Banana Bliss first. Oh wow, you can really taste the banana in here. Well, I should have got a bigger one. They had a small size and a big size. And this is awesome. 
Mm. I could drink this whole thing right now. Let's try the other one. Frozen apple pie. Mm. That's really good too. It's a very creative drink. It has like apple pie crumbles on top and then and it's non-alcoholic too. Awesome. In the bottom of this, <clears throat> there's like apple pie filling. Wow, very sweet. The banana bliss was so good, I got a second one. And it's the large size. Cheers. Take a cruise through the UK pavilion. And Alice is here. Hi. Okay, I came to the France pavilion and it might be 120 degrees outside. And I waited in a line for like 30 minutes in the sun to get this. So let me try it and I'll let you know how it is. Tastes like Thanksgiving dinner. It's delicious. It's got like a gravy on it. Duck gravy. And mashed sweet potatoes. That's awesome. I would eat this again. Very good. Duck L'Orange with mashed sweet potatoes. Oh, taking a break from the outside. I've got 20 minutes until the American Adventure. This is one of my faves and it's a great place to cool off. So far, it's been a great day. Hi, Francesca Fun. What a great show. I could go and watch that all day long. After seeing that show, you just gotta have a cider. I think I'm gonna head out of here though and go to Disney Springs. It's getting a little crowded. this butter bar from the caramel kushia in Germany this is the best thing I've had the whole trip oh my god mm. all kinds
caramel. So good. Delicious. Last bite. You have to get this. You come here, you have to get this. Caramel butter bar. It's like caramel with like a cookie base, with some salt in there. Awesome. I think I'll skip Germany. Heading across to China through the desert. Warm. today. Just a few reminders. Please wear a face covering at all times, except when actively eating or drinking while stationary. Clean your hands often and thoroughly. Cover your mouth and nose when coughing and sneezing, and maintain physical distancing. Thank you. This is the real tragedy. The Kringle Bakery is closed. Kind of a sad, sad day here. All the lights are out. Come to Norway, and this is probably the best thing about Norway. Sad, kind of right there. And none of the meet and greets are going. The Royal Summer House is closed in summer. Now we're going to meet Anna and Elsa. Going into Mexico. Like a nice Mexican evening. Oh. All right, got the impossible slider. You can see, it actually looks pretty good. Let's see if it tastes any good. That's good. That's really good. Spicy. You got like a spicy slaw on it. I've made these before at home, but this is way better. Way better than I'm used to. It's good. I don't know if it's the spicy carrots or what. I mean, if you didn't tell me, I think this is a burger. Definitely. Mm. I'd say the second best thing I had all day, if not the first. The first being the uh, the duck. But this this is a contender. Standby entrance is 50 minutes. I don't think I'll be doing this one. But 50 minutes, too much. We'll go over and check out Mouse Gear. Temporary location for Mouse Gear. <sighs> yeah. 
think that's gonna do it for today. I'm gonna leave the park now because I feel like I'm on fire. But look at this. It's the new show building for Guardian's Ride. Very cool. It's huge. Today was pretty cool. I went on Soren. I went on the land. Went on Spaceship Earth. Got some food from the Food and Wine Festival. Saw the American Adventure and uh, lit myself on fire from the sun. So now the long walk back to the buses. Even with all this uh, Epcot construction, do you think it's still worth the price of admission? Because they haven't changed the prices. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Should I ride Spaceship Earth one more time? I think I might have to. It's probably a walk on. Why not? Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> there is no line. Hi there. I don't know how I'm supposed to socially distance. By the time I catch up to these people, I'm gonna be on the ride. Who doesn't love Spaceship Earth? Okay, well I'm back at the room and I'm hanging out. I left the park about two hours early because I was spent from the heat. I had a good time. It was really, really fun. Just walking around, seeing everything. A lot of construction being done at Epcot. And um, yeah, overall it was a great day. I came back to relax. I have myself a Amaretz Patisserie. This is a salted caramel chocolate eclair and then I have a glass of milk and I have a cup of tea so get some rest and then tomorrow I may or may not go to Hollywood Studios I may just head home to get home early um, and walk around maybe take some photos and that's gonna be it hope you guys enjoyed this video hope you enjoyed all the videos and we'll see you in the next one let me know in the comments down below what you think. If you're not subscribed, please do so. And hit that thumbs up button. Thanks so much. Bye, dudes.